Daryl Crow. Good morning, Your Honor. Good morning, sir. Who's the little guy with you? Yeah, my son, Jacob. Say hi. Hi, young man. What's your name? Jacob. Jacob? How old are you, Jacob? Five. Come up here. See if you can help me out. <laughs> okay. Would you mind if I sit him on my lap? No, he's fine. <laughs> here we go. All right, Jacob. How old are you? Five. Okay. Do you go to school yet? Mm, no. Not real school. Not really? September. He starts kindergarten in September. Yeah. Do you have any idea what you want to do when you get to be a little older, like when you graduate from school? Mm, a cook. A cook? <laughs> that what you said, a cook? Yeah. Me and my dad work at a pizza place. Me and my dad are great cooks. Yeah? Okay. <laughs> what, would you, what, what do you think you'd like to cook? What would be the best? What do you like the best? Pizza. <laughs> well, so far you're doing pretty good. I'm having trouble with this case uh, because I have a situation where your dad is charged with parking on a street up on the east side. And I have three choices. I can fine him $90, I can charge him $30, or I can charge him nothing. What do you think I should do? 30 30 <laughs> <laughs> so you're a pretty good judge. Now, there was an old, uh, there's an old story about King Solomon, who everyone quotes, and King Solomon was, was all powerful, and usually he would split the difference. You know, he'd pick a middle road, and that's exactly what you did, and that's a very logical way to think. Is there anything better than 30, you think? Mm, none. None? Is that what you said? Yeah. Have, uh, have you had breakfast yet? Mm, no. No. Well, I suppose I make a deal with your dad, okay? Uh, and the deal is that if he'll take you out for breakfast, then I'll dismiss the ticket. What do you think about that? Yeah. <laughs> you like that? No, I want you to order up a pretty good, I want you to order a lot of stuff because he's going to be saving 30 bucks. Is that a good deal? Yeah, it's a little big. Okay. <laughs> All right, thanks for helping me out.